I tried various diets over the years, various, various diets over the years. Um, uh, normally, I like just calorie count. I normally lost some, some weight. Um, I tried Slim World. I lost a big chunk of weight. Um, tried going to the gym a little bit. Tried various things, to be honest. But I even tried tablets at the doctor's. Um, and the doctor's got some tablets and lost weight that way. Um, ultimately, what happened? Excess takeaways, excess drink, and excess lifestyle got in the way. Always put the weight back on. What was missing? My belief. My belief was really missing. And Naz and the program has given me that belief, empowered me to give me that belief. The program was so simple. Yeah, it was unbelievably simple. Um, <clears throat> I remember week one, it was, let's sit down, talk through where you're at, talk through what you want, come up with some goals, and then asking me various questions about where I was at that point. And then as the weeks developed, where did I want to be? And then what did I have to do to get to the stage I wanted to be? But it was tiny little goals, three goals every single week. Tiny little goals. Like I, I remember week one, my goals were to have one takeaway, to have one chocolate biscuit a day. And I was like, no, I can have takeaway on this diet. I can have chocolate biscuits every day on this diet. And all I've got to do is go for a walk. Really? Nah, that's not a diet. And then I suddenly realized that this was more than just fitness. This was about mindset. I remember him saying, you may not want to take some photos of yourself topless and send us them, but I think you'll regret it if you don't. So I think you should. Right, okay. And then I remember the first time I seen the photographs back at like month one, I actually rang my mate and went, are you ready to see some naked photos of me? And he was like, are you joking? No. And I went, it's all right, it's just topless. And he sh I showed him these photos because I was so excited and so proud. And it wasn't just about weight loss. It was, it was about the measurements as well. So the chest and the waist and the centimeters lost. I remember him saying to me at one stage, I can't remember which point it was, but I remember him saying to me at one stage, just borrow my confidence. Because I said, I'm not sure that this is going to work for me. Let me lend you my confidence. You'll be all right. And when I came back and I stood on the, sta the scales, I walked in the house and I was on the scales because I wanted to know had I blown it and I hadn't blown it. And I was gobsmacked that I hadn't blown it. But I was so proud that I hadn't blown it at the same time. And I just thought, you know what? I had an absolutely outstanding holiday. And I had an outstanding holiday whilst having as much fun. No. Having more fun than what I normally would have done. When you're my size, I'm six foot four, and when you're my weight, and walking around a pool, it's not fun with your top off. You see all of the, the skinny people knocking around, and you just think, oh, I just look like a beach whale here. I had my top off most of the time. I was there. I was proud of who I was. I was genuinely proud of who I was. What did that enable? It enabled the fact that my daughter pushed me in the pool. I'm stood at the side of the pool. She came along. She was only eight. She pushed me straight in the pool. I wouldn't have been stood with me swim, just my swim shorts on at the side of the pool 12 weeks ago. Would not have done that. When he sent us that T-shirt, I just remember thinking, like, what the heck? It's a 2XL. And I remember going, right, I'm going to put this on and see how stupid it is and how much I've got to lose. Because he'd asked us, and I said, oh, I reckon I'll fit a 3XL. Now. And he sent us it, and I went, I'm going to try this on. And I put this T-shirt on, and I went, it fits? No. And I came back to it, and I went, you're a miracle worker or something like that. I've got no idea how the heck we've done this, but I feel it was 2XL. And I was so excited. I feel like he celebrates my successes at the same time. I feel like he really, really cares. Because somehow, together, we're in a 2XL. The shirt's a 4XL. And it's massive on us. Yeah, it's absolutely massive on us. I need to go and buy a new wardrobe, thanks to the sword now. <laughs> If you're thinking about working with Nas, if you're serious 
about your health, if you're serious about wanting to make a difference, instead of just doing what we've all done and saying that, you know what, I'm going to lose some weight on my holiday. I'm going to get back. I'm going to lose some weight for Christmas. I'm going to lose some weight to go and do whatever. And doing fad diets, diets that last a couple of months, you see some results and then you go back to your usual self. If you're serious about making major changes to your life, with not a huge amount of effort, not a huge, huge, huge amount of effort, but a massive change in your mindset, then work with NASA. If you're not serious about it, then don't bother. Don't waste your time and definitely don't waste his time because NAS changes lives. He genuinely, genuinely changes lives. So don't waste his time. He's too valuable because there is people out there that he will change their lives. I am one of those people.